Amravati, September 14, the Andhra Pradesh High Court on Wednesday granted anticipatory bail to former Minister Ponguru Narayana in a case relating alleged irregularities in sale of assigned lands in the Amravati region. In an interim order on a petition by Narayana, the court barred the CID from arresting him for three months. The Telugu Desham Party, TDP, leader had filed the petition seeking anticipatory bail on health grounds, telling the court that he may have to travel abroad for medical treatment. This came a day after the special investigation team of CID probing the case arrested five close aides of Narayana. The CID arrested Kohli Sivaram, an employee of Ramakrishna Housing Limited, Gatam Venkatesh, Chikkala Vijaya Saradhi, KK Dora Babu and Bade Anjaniulu under various sections of the Indian Penal Code, IPC, the SC and ST Prevention of Atrocities, Act, and the Prevention of Corruption Act. According to the CID, the accused committed various irregularities in the purchase of 1,100 acres in villages in Amravati region. The case was registered in 2020 on a complaint by Vai Prasad Kumar. As then Municipal Administration and Urban Development Minister, Narayana had allegedly orchestrated the illegal purchase of assigned land in the capital city area, using his own relatives and acquaintances as Benami transactions, it said. Assigned lands are the lands allotted by the government to the scheduled castes and scheduled tribes and as per the rules, they can't be purchased or sold. The investigating team claimed that the then minister ignored the findings of then Guntur collector Kantilal Dund and then CRDA commissioner Cherukuri Sridhar the CID claimed to have so far unearthed a financial trail of 15 crore rupees from the accused to the family members of Narayana through the bank accounts of Ramakrishna Housing Limited Narayana and his associates allegedly created insecurity in the minds of gullible farmers who were in the possession of assigned lands or encroachers or occupants of government lands, more particularly the SCs and backward castes. Some revenue officials spread a message that the government would take away the assigned lands from the persons who are in their possession. According to the CID, Narayana, who is Mr., had powers to grant town layouts and buildings permissions, allegedly conspired with KPV Anjani Kumar, director of Ramakrishna Housing Limited to purchase the assigned lands at very low prices. The case was registered after the YSR Congress Party, YSRCP, came to power. The party alleged that during the previous TDP government, many of its leaders committed irregularities with regard to land transactions before announcing that Amravati will be developed as the new state capital. Last week, the High Court had granted anticipatory bail to Narayana in the case registered by the CID with respect to alleged land dealings in the guise of Inner Ring Road Alignment and Amravati Capital City Master Plan. The CID earlier filed a case against TDP President and former Chief Minister N. Chandrababu Naidu, former Minister Narayana and others based on a complaint filed by Mangalagiri MLA Allah Ramakrishna Reddy alleging that land deals had taken place in the name of change in Amravati Inner Ring Road Alignment Design. Narayana, Realtor Lingamaneni Ramesh, his brother Lingamaneni Venkat Surya Rajshekhar, and Jani Kumar and others were named as accused by the CID in the case. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to channel and click on bell for more daily videos.